name's Ray Gasser. Uh, we've been farming here in Southwest Iowa since 1978. Our history here has been, uh, you know, we've been no-tilling almost everything uh, for the last 30 years. Uh, and we think it's really important to maintain the soil, you know, to build up organic matter. Uh, and, and we were been really, I, I think, successful at controlling erosion and, and building that organic matter on our soils for, for almost 30 years. But in the last several years, uh, you know, we've had such severe rain events and, and you know, three or four inches in an hour or, or eight to ten inches of rain overnight. And, and our, our conservation practices, our no-till, our waterways, our terraces just aren't enough to handle those kind of events. Our goal is to have a cover crop on every acre, you know, but that might be five years down the road uh, because it's just a learning process for us now. You know, it's, it's going to take more time in the fall to get the cover crop seeded. It's going to take more management in the spring to get the, get the cover crops terminated at the proper time. We farm about 6,000 acres total. Uh, uh, about 1,200 this year's cover crops. Uh, we started three years ago with 200 acres of cover crops. Last year we did about 1,000 acres and this year we're 1,200. Uh, we're trying to learn as we go to see what works best. So in this particular field is, is cereal rye and it was planted uh, 10 days ago. So in one week uh, it, it was already up and growing and, and that's the advantage that we see in our climate here in Iowa uh, because we have a limited amount of growth between harvest and, and the time we freeze up. Uh, we need something that's pretty aggressive, we think. The main benefit, the main concern for us today is, is conservation and erosion control, but you know, we see uh, you know, the ability to maybe build up on our soil health, and there, you know, those are the advantages that we see uh, you know, down the road as we do uh, continuous cover crops every year. We think we will build the soil health and, and make, it, you know, make our yields of our soybeans and corns even better down the road. I, I believe that uh, I think it's something that is really going to grow because I do believe that there will that we will find there's lots of benefits to cover crops uh, in addition to erosion control, nutrient sequestration, you know the the soil health things. You know we do care about the land here on our farm and we're concerned about it and we want to do the best job that we can to maintain the, the health of the soil, to maintain the soil that's in place. All those I think will uh, will find lots of benefits.